Hi, my name is Vijay. I'm from CFL, and today we are here to interview the topper of JE Mains of Dakshina Kannada, Anish Joshi, the son of Ramachandra Joshi and Renuka Joshi. Here we asked a few questions that will enable you, the students of 11th there and students of 10th there, uh, become toppers like Anish Joshi. The first question to him, Anish, tell me what was your prepare? How does it feel like to be a topper in Dakshin Kannada? It feels uh, really good that I get the seat that I want. And, and which is the seat that you really want? Uh, from J M X, I really wanted an ITK CS. Okay, and I'll get that. So I'm really happy. wonderful. So Anish, and there must have been you've you've been from Karpala, right? Tell, tell me a brief history about you. How did you move from Karpala? Where did you go to school? And then your journey to CFL. So I completed my high school in Nyana Sudha. It's a okay. college. It's a school in Karkala. And then I wanted to focus more on the competitive exams like JEE Main. So I came here to CFL, okay. and it really paid off. Paid off. Okay, but you did really well. So I had heard that while you were in Nyana Sudha, you don't you're not exposed to many competitive exams other than NDSC, which yeah. you did around 130, 140 there, yeah. and then you come here and go and top. J main, which is impressive. What was your preparation to J main like? Uh, J main for J main, I prepared for the past two years. I used to study every day, and CFA used to be till like five thirty, and then I would go home and start studying by like six six thirty, and okay. I would start studying. I'd study for two hours. I would take a small break after that. Okay. So you would study around three or four hours a day. Uh, more than that, yeah, yeah, three or five hours. Three to five hours a day. So I heard that when you were preparing, uh, other than your individual study, you used to also discuss with your uh, friends or classmates from CFL. How did that go? Uh, so there's an app called Discord. Okay. We it allows us to voice chat and share our screen there. Okay. So we used to solve a lot of problems okay. with with my friends, and it really helped me. If I had a doubt, I could ask them, and if they had a doubt, I could clear it. It really helped. Yeah. Me prepare for this. So that was your group discussion, like yeah, at home. Yeah. Okay. Who are your friends, and what each did? Each friend, what did they contribute to you? Uh, my friends, I had a small group of like six people. Okay. It included Prabha, Anand Krishna, okay. Arvind, Adil, and Adil. Okay. Uh, we used to sort together, and it really helped. Me. Okay. Uh, um, how many mock tests did you give, and uh, and how did you review your mock test? I gave around sixty to seventy mock tests, and uh, I used to give a mock every day. Uh, some of which were previous year papers. Okay. I used to after the mock, I used to look at the questions that went wrong, and I would revise the chapters again that I made a mistake in. Okay. And that I also used to make a lot of silly errors like calculation errors, and writing a lot of mocks helped me reduce it in actual GMAs. Okay. How was your uh, breakdown between physics, chemistry, and uh, math? So physics was my favorite, so I used to attempt that first, okay. and uh, then I used to attempt chemistry, okay. and I would keep a lot of time for maths, like one and a half hours okay. or more for maths, because it the papers that the recent maths papers are very lengthy, so okay. you will need more time for that. So that was your strategy: yeah. give physics first, then chemistry, and then leave the time for maths. Yeah, and you kept that strategy consistent. Yeah. I did. Okay. Um, what are the other exams you're planning to give other than GMATs? I have already given CET and Comet K. Okay. I have given one attempt of bits, and there's gonna be another bits attempt tomorrow. Tomorrow. Yeah. Wishing you all the best for it. Mm-hmm. Even in Karnataka CET, uh, even in the boards, what are your marks in the boards? Uh, in PCM, I yeah. got all hundred. You got hundred. Congrats on that. Okay. And and how much did you score in the CET exam? Uh, I scored one fifty six out of one eighty. Wow. So now with that, you got a rank of one hundred and twenty two. Yeah. So that would also give you the top colleges in Karnataka, yeah. RV or come CS in RV yeah, yeah. or anything. Good. So now, uh, what is if you had your dream branch in the country and dream college, which should that be? Of course, that would be IIT. IIT so, CS. IIT CS. Yeah. That would be a huge milestone. Yeah. Are you going to be ready for that? I am going to prepare for that. We'll see that. August twenty eighth. August. All the best for that. Thank you. Now, what about triple IITs? Triple IITs are also very good for CS. Are you considering them? Are you going yeah, to try? Yeah, I'm considering them. Through UG, I got uh, triple IIT Hyderabad okay. C, five year MSc. Okay. And through JEE Mains also there's B Tech course which I'm trying for right. Okay. So you've you've now you've got an IIT Kesaradkal, 
triple IIT Hyderabad, possibly BITS, possibly all the colleges in Karnataka, and you're now only trying for the IITs. Yeah. Okay. Now a lot of the students who are very interested in JE and engineering never give the KBPY exam, and now that's cancelled as well. But did giving KBPY and Olympiads help you? Uh, yeah, they did. They gave me a feel of what the where I stand in the country and. That also gave me confidence when the name came in the extended list. Okay. That you are in among the top. Yeah. What is the rank in KPPY? Uh, two thousand. So thirty-eight. That gave you a list that you are two thousand yeah. in the two thousand range in the country. That's pretty good. That that's the only help you got. Yeah. Okay. okay. So if you had to pass on a message to the students who are in tenth and eleventh, what would that be, and how they should prepare? Things that you have done have worked for you, and things you. Wish you had done, and which you want them to do. Uh, only thing that everybody should follow is they should not waste time. Okay. They should study every day, and consistency is the key. Okay. That's the thing. What you wish you had done? You've done everything you wanted to. I think. Yeah. Okay. Congratulations. Thank you. And thank you for today.